common practice in industry is to use assessments as a decision support tool, which is often later in the process. Uh, these insights validate earlier data points from interviews and the like. It's a usually a, a number of candidates. So for any vendors that are charging per candidate, then it reduces cost. Uh, but we actually encourage, we're practical, to introduce our assessments earlier in the process, uh, where, again, it's, a, it's appropriate to do so. So that can include scenarios like higher volume uh, roles, where you can use it as an efficiency tool up front earlier in the pipeline. Use the data to identify those candidates that have the strongest results and start talking to them first. So your talent acquisition team has a limited number of hours available to talk to a limited Limited number of candidates start where the, the candidates are showing the greatest strength for, for the particular job. Um, another use case is exploring unta untapped talent pools. So let demonstrated skills speak for themselves rather than traditional methods such as, as resume, especially if applications are low. Uh, using your test, these tests that allow a candidate to demonstrate actual job skill uh, earlier in the process means you can be more open-minded to those raw skills, not just work history and experience. You might find a diamond in the rough. They don't have the experience you were looking for, but they've shown you they have the skills and the potential. So certainly it allows you to consider candidates that you might otherwise not have looked at uh, because you have that data. Um, now, I, I, there are some caveats to this. Bringing assessment earlier in the, the recruitment funnel, it's, it's new. It's not the typical way industry has used assessment. And there are some, some things to consider. Um, but it can feel a little impersonal, like you click on a job ad, you don't really know much about the role or the company, but it's piqued your interest, and then you're invited to complete a comprehensive assessment. Oh, that can feel, you know, do I want to go through that when I'm not sure about the job yet? But we can overcome that with ramping up our candidate engagement, um, adding an intro video, explaining the process, sharing as much as possible upfront about the role, the team, the company, really bringing the opportunity to life in a video form um, can invite and compel a candidate to take that next step. Um, the other consideration that's important is in some jurisdictions, it might not be appropriate to use uh, assessment as a standalone screening tool. And so it's important to verify job relevancy, to consider multi-measure assessment, especially in high stakes hiring and in jurisdictions that have regulation around this. Mm -hmm.